My skin would flare up. I would then break that down with the itching. And through those little cracks, I would then get staph infections. I had a crack in the corner of my lip and staph got in there and it quickly found its way to my bloodstream. And so I ended up with septicemia. My survival rate was not great. Um, the hospital covered me in corticosteroid creams and then they'd wrap me in bandages. I remember my various family members coming to the hospital to visit, but they were just, they were just coming there to say hi and I guess hoping that I wasn't gonna pass away. <laughs> With eczema, it feels like a treatment will work for a while, and then after a period of time, that treatment stops working. So I decided that I would try a new treatment, which is more of a targeted immunosuppressant. So it's looking at two markers that affect eczema and asthma, rather than a full systemic immunosuppressant. So you're less likely to get sick, you're less likely to get infections, but it's dampening that immune response. Probably within three days, I could notice such a huge difference. I was not as itchy. You could see the inflammation in my skin going down. And so I've been able to do so much more. I've been, even been able to wear my wedding rings for the first time in two years, <laughs> which is just, yeah, amazing. <laughs>